What's up everybody on YouTube? How's everybody doing? I'm doing just fine. They're doing awesome actually. So today, welcome back to another episode on the Afterlife server. Episode 35, I believe. I think. I'm not sure. <laughs> been recording so much Afterlife and just so much videos in general. It's been awesome. So thank you guys for all the support on everything. Um, and speaking of support, make sure to go check out our Discord where we're posting Minecraft screenshots on there. You can post Minecraft screenshots, memes, and just chat with the, the Afterlife community in general. It's, it's awesome. Fantastic place to go to. And also check out all the other Afterlife members as well. Um, because, you know, you want you want to show support to everybody on the server. It's pretty cool. So make sure to go do that. It's awesome. But yeah. Um, what else is there? I don't think there's anything else I got to remind you of. But, guys, we have a problem. <laughs> we have a little bit of a problem. We, you know, in last episode, we were dropping in the reinforcements. White was kind of helping us with that, getting us... Getting that down, getting, you know, kind of like a little bit of payback. It's not too harsh. We're just, we're just dropping some turtles on their houses. Not too, not too bad. Um, but we have a little bit of a problem. And that is this. <laughs> I believe we are the last Team Turtle member. Well, let's go see. Let's actually go. Okay. Yes. Yes, we are. We are the last one. Has, has Rudy taken his down yet? No, he hasn't. So he'll be the last tech last one technically but he's he's not in team turtle so we are the last team turtle member to take down this monstrosity this plastic bag over our house you know that's it's it's making the environment nasty and gross so we need to get rid of this and i think that's what we're going to be doing in the first part of this episode i got more planned for this episode don't worry but we need to get rid of this first this is this is main priority all right and just like that it's gone that took about an hour even with a haste two beacon and also an efficiency five pickaxe and my pickaxe is almost completely gone here but just take a moment just to look how much glass this took them to produce my goodness that is insane that's a lot of glass but it's all mine now i have a lot of light blue glass i'm probably gonna have to use that in my designs but i won't need any other glass from now on but yeah uh oh it's so it's so great to see my house again without the blue shell it doesn't look like a hologram anymore but yeah Lots of cleanup to do, lots of things to kind of work around and just start cleaning up things, start cleaning up all this mess we got everywhere. Um, we also need to start finishing up some projects over at the Team Turtle HQ because we do have a lot of plans over here to kind of start to finish up, start to, you know, bring everything together, um, you know, tie in the loose ends and all that stuff. And one of those things is actually having a bridge that goes all the way to the Team Turtle HQ area. And what I was thinking is, potentially maybe we can have a bridge that goes all the way along here, and then possibly have a bridge up there somehow. I mean, I'm trying to still figure out how this is gonna go, and just kind of figuring out all of this. So, I mean, I guess we could talk about it for a minute. Um, so there was like a nice little area over here where we can make, potentially add like a little bridge it goes along here or maybe we can ex do like a bridge that goes this way and then a bridge that kind of extends up this way and make a path that goes up here and then just kind of fill this out a little bit so i mean that's one thing we could potentially do uh also another thing we have to do is you know add in some interior here so this might take a couple episodes we might break this up into a couple episodes or um, or maybe just do it in one. I'm not sure what I'm going to be doing yet, but I'm going to need to go gather up some resources, maybe lay out a few things, and then I can give you a better idea of what's going to be happening. But yeah, guys, so we have done a little bit something different with this over here. Uh, I decided to make the entrance for the main building to be on this side, because if it's on this side, well, we're kind of running into a little bit of an issue, and I would have to build a bridge here, and I don't think it really makes sense to have a bridge here when we have a big, massive bridge down here. So my idea is to try to put it on this side and then make like a little pathway or something that, you know, um, is not very futuristic. I'm going to make a very like kind of, you know, uh, you know, rough pathway um, and just kind of make a little bridge and then like do a little bridge down here. Um, try to do something like that instead. Because the alternative is to actually make a bridge that goes let me show you from here to there and i'm going to decorate that side up a little bit i'm going to add some stone and a site start to flush this out maybe some leaves or something uh but it, the alternative would be to have a bridge that goes from here to here and then from here to here 
and then eventually make a pathway that goes all the way over there. But that doesn't seem very practical. When we have a, a massive bridge that's going to be over here, we're going to have majority of the Team Turtle, like the left, you know, the rest of the Team Turtle builds be in this area over here. Um, it doesn't really make sense to have that. So we're going to make this the main entrance into the Team Turtle area. And uh, I think that's the way we're going to go. Uh, but let me show you the bridge real quick. Let me show you the outline that I have. So right here, um, I have like these sort of pillars where the pillars are going to go for the bridge. And then this is how big the pathway is actually going to be or how, how big the bridge is going to be. So I had to modify the pathway a little bit. I'm going to extend it out a little bit on this side. That way it kind of like this little twist and then you're on the bridge, right? Um, so yeah, and then it's going to come across here. And yeah, so and what's perfect is, is that there's like a little like island area right here. So I could put a pillar right there and then there's like two, you know, waterways that go through. Which I think is pretty cool. It works out pretty nice. And then we're going to have like a big, you know, pathway here. And then a big area right here. And I'm thinking I'm going to put like some sort of vehicle or something right here. Kind of like parked alongside the factory. Which I think would be pretty cool. And then we're going to have a staircase that goes down here. And then blends in with the sanctuary over here. So we might put like a gate or something here. But that, I mean, we're not going to do all that in today's episode. Maybe we will. I don't know. We'll see. I'm just having fun. I'm just building, listening to the music and just kind of chilling on Afterlife right now. And it's it's been really fun. So uh, let me get back to work and uh, yeah. And just like that, the bridge is done, and I've done a lot of progress on this. I absolutely love this bridge. Oh my gosh. It's, it's, it's so easy to build with concrete. It's like building with Legos, almost. Uh, so if you're, you know, you struggle with building, like in the medieval style, I highly recommend trying out this style, trying something a little different. Uh, because you don't have to focus on texture as much as, as much as shape and all that stuff, and color. You just have to focus on which colors you want to use and all that stuff, which colors go great together. But yeah, this style I have had, I'm so inspired by, you know, with the Turtle HQ, uh, what, what White Fire did with it, with the farms over there. It just looks, it just comes together quite nicely and, you know, really blends in. And it doesn't, it doesn't intrude with the uh, the main spawn area. So it's, it's kind of nice off to the side and you feel like you're walking into like a different realm over here, more industrial area. Uh, but it looks pretty good. I'm very happy with how this bridge turned out. I like how this light blue glass goes along. This wasn't in the original design. But I added it in just as like a little railing 
I think it works pretty good. So very nice. We also have this little pathway right here, which I think looks pretty good as well. I mean, hey, you know, I got to try out some different things. You know, this is a pretty, you know, non-textured textured pathway. You know, we're just going with some simple transitions here, and I think it works out pretty good. Uh, what else do we have? Oh, yeah, I have to finish off this, like, little fence post design I've been doing. It's it's sort of the same as the, you know, Turtle HQ up there, uh, but I added in some sea lanterns just to kind of light it up a little bit. You can see it better over here, um, just to add in a little bit of lighting. So, yeah, it kind of works out pretty good. Um, yeah, I really like how this area is coming along. So... But, oh yeah, I forgot to show you. I also did this as well. Uh, so if you go up this little pathway now, there's a little pathway. And it's like texturized and all that stuff. It's got little stones and stuff. Um, and it leads all the way up to Turtle HQ over here. So, yeah, we'll probably get to the interior of this in another episode. Uh, but yeah, for the time being, I wanted to work on this little bridge down here. Because, I don't know, I feel like it's something I can kind of show you and just kind of work with you on camera. So... You know, you kind of take your basic shape with this, right? You kind of, when, you, when I'm building in this style, I'm like, okay, what do I want the bridge to look like? Or, you know, it's any structure in general. I start with one block. I start with, you know, using one block and then I add to that one block. So right here, you can see I already kind of laid out how the pillars are going to go. So maybe I want to do something like this. I'm going to bring some slabs across. Sometimes we make them little happy mistakes like that. Sometimes you got to let them go. Um... But yeah, we'll bring we'll bring those slabs across. Just kind of add a little bit of support to the side, and I think that's really going to help us with this build in general. And you try, you know, when you're building in this style, you want to try to keep, you know, keep to you know three different types of blocks and the stone slabs. You know, they kind of work work out pretty good in, in a nice contrast. So I think the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to try to like inset this by one. So I'm going to add a little bit of white over here, and we'll just see kind of how that turns out. Um, oh, no, I don't want to do that. There we, look. there we go. I want it to be back one like this, so we can inset it. I think that looks okay, right? Not too bad. Something like that, potentially. Yeah, that looks pretty good. And then we'll kind of, like, angle it down. Let's, say, let's stand back and take a look at that. Oh, I like that. That is nice. That is a good good thing right there. And then we'll kind of... Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll do that on the other side. So, yeah, let's do a little flip-flop just like this. And we'll bring that across. Bring you down. Yeah, I like this. So, let's take a look at that. Yeah, pretty good. We got to add in our slabs. Not too bad, not too bad. So yeah, it's a very simple little bridge design. You know, we're not going over any water or anything. You know, the water sort of ends off right here. Um, potentially, you know, we might have the water go all the way through, but yeah, I kind I wanted to make this like a little turtle beach over here, a little area for the turtles to kind of you know hang out. And I want to kind of have those a little bit everywhere, you know, so just to have it kind of dot it here and there. I think the next thing we can do here is maybe add in some uh, sea lanterns along the side. So maybe some sea lanterns right here. And then maybe break this up by adding a little bit of green in there. Yeah, I think that's going to look pretty good. I think that's going to look pretty good. So let's do that on this side and just, again, stand back, take a look at it. Oh, yeah, I like that. That is That is wonderful. That is a wonderful thing. So we'll just add that in on this side right here. The one right here. You're not going to really be able to see this pillar, but we're still going to do it anyway. Just for the sake of the build. There we go. And just so it equals up a little bit. I might have to trim this back a little bit, this edge, but I yeah, will leave it as is. It's fine. Yeah, I think that's good for the sides. I think that's, I think that's going to be fine. Maybe I'll add in a little slab there. Just to kind of equal it off and maybe a little bit of a, a white thing like that. Yeah, it looks pretty good. That way it's equal across the board, and let's just check the other side to see if it, we need to do the same thing. Um, do we have to do the same thing? No, 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 we don't. No, we don't, I don't think we do. <laughs> All right, let's do, a, let's do a little bit of sleeping real quick. Do a little bit of sleep, lovely. 
Absolutely wonderful. There we go. Okay, so now what else are we going to be doing here? So let's add in some little little things like this, little toppers to these little pillar areas. Then maybe we'll have some more green along the side here because we don't have a lot of green in this build. So we want to kind of add in a little bit of color just like that. And then maybe, just maybe, and maybe a little bit of this light blue going along the sides here just to add, a, again, a little bit of color. I think that's looking okay. Yeah, let's just let's try that out. Let's see how that looks. Uh, we'll stand back, take a look at it, because I'm trying to add in a little railing here. It's kind of hard to do that on the diagonal, though. Oh, and then we got to add on our other one over here. There we go. Oh, won't do that. <laughs> There we go. Okay, we'll stand back, take a look at it from the other bridge. Just to see how we like it. I think I do. Oh, yeah, I do. I really like that. That's not too bad. That actually is not bad for a diagonal bridge. But yes, everybody, I think that's going to do it for this episode of the Afterlife SMP. Um, this one, definitely a lot of progress getting done in it. We did so much. We did... You know, we did the pathway going up to Team Turtle HQ. We did this bridge that we're on right now. We did the other bridge. We did the pathways in front of the factories. And yeah, if you're wondering what's going on with that factory back there, you're going to have to wait until the next episode. Little bit of a sneak peek. But yeah, guys. Hang in there. Uh, make sure to check out all the other Afterlife members. Be sure to check out our Discord. And also, that's it. <laughs> check out the Afterlife Hub channel, too, because we got... Ooh, we have some cool stuff going on over there. But yeah, guys, that's going to do it. As always, don't forget to be awesome. And I'll see you guys next time.